Today, I've been to the food warehouse, um, which is something that you may not have near you, but it's really worth looking up if you do. Um, this one, the food warehouse that we've got near us is owned by Iceland and you can still use your Iceland bonus card, um, which is just incredible. So um, yeah, you can use it in store. You get a pound for every 20 pounds that you save and loads of offers and bonuses. So what is not great about the food warehouse? It's incredible. Some of the prices of the food that I've found to do this haul video um, have been amazing. Obviously at the moment, everybody seems to be stockpiling um, and I get that. For me, um, I have to bulk buy because it's cheaper. Places like, places like the food warehouse make my life easier because I am on a budget with the boys. At the moment, I'm kind of preparing and thinking ahead for the possibility of Easter holidays being quarantined or if one of them gets poorly, we're gonna be in lockdown and I'm gonna to have to have the kids at home and three boys, believe me, eat a lot, a lot of food. Let me tell you what I've managed to get this morning up at the food warehouse. They were run out of toilet rolls um, due to the coronavirus panic buying um, episode that's going on. But other than that, nothing else seemed to be out of stock. Loads of cereals, that they tend to come in bigger boxes and they are much cheaper and it's always worth having a quick look on your phone to do a price match. So here I've got 50 Irish pork sausages and actually the ingredients, I always check the ingredients because sometimes you associate cheaper food with um, brutal ingredients, stuff that's just not good for you. But I actually find that a lot of Iceland products the ingredients is really, really good. Not hideous to be feeding your children and their friends because you do tend to have a lot of kids around here. 50 sausages really won't last me that long. You're probably thinking that girl can stay at home for months with her three kids. Really can't. Um, they do these, which are just fantastic. Five pounds for these breaded strips. And again, it's Iceland quality, you know, chicken breast strips. So no nasty massive family bag of french fry chips there these are aussie's favorites that's two pounds 69 for that two pounds for 18 pots of the wildlife fromage fray yogurts so again a big favorite of aussie's um check this out 139 chicken nuggets for five quid you read oh sorry 135 god I feel like I've just been done out of four chicken nuggets. Um, yes, just incredible price. You won't find a price like that anywhere else. This is just an incredible price. 10 cartons of Jaffa cakes in there for five quid, making them 50p a packet. And I have never seen them that cheap anywhere else. Um, I think it's either Co-op or Tesco's that I was in the other day and they were down to a pound a packet, which I thought was brilliant. So 50p a packet is just an off the scale saving there. Um, 2 89 for those, as I've said, but these are something that my boys really like. They work out at £1.50 a bag. So these, you get um, three for three pounds. So we've got, um, these ones are pressed apple juice. Diggory particularly likes tropical juice. They could never all like the same thing, could they? Three boys, or like something different, just to make my life a little bit more tricky. Um, mango juice, Diggory loves mango juice. Um, so again, and they're all the same price, those are absolutely fab. This is £1.79 um, for chocolate chip muffins. There's 14 in there. And the nice thing is they're all individually wrapped. We've got a two pack of strawberry jelly there to make up. Ozzy loves it. He loves snipping the jelly with the scissors and stirring it and watching them get smaller. I can remember doing it when I was little and he really enjoys that. That's a pound for two. So again, 50p. In the food warehouse, this was two pounds, which is a massive saving anyway on Heinz tomato ketchup. But this one, I think there's a litre in here. Is it a litre bottle? Oh my gosh, 1,170 millilitres. There's over a litre of ketchup there for two pounds 39. 
So that's two quid and that's 2.39. So where I don't like <laughs> that ginormous bottle on my dining table, I will refill one of the smaller bottles with that because that saving, you just can't say no to that. £2.39. I do not know where you could buy Heinz ketchup for that price anywhere else. Um, one pound for these jam tarts. The boys do like making them, but when we've got uh, time to make them, which isn't always. So these, here we've got um, these bird's eye breaded cod fingers. They're six pounds each for 30. So again, quite a good saving on those. One pound 79 for all these bananas. Oh my gosh. Um, just fab. I don't know how many's in there. Oh, there's nine bananas in there for one pound 79. So fantastic price on those. One pound for scampi, which again, such a good saving. Um, another really good thing to just have in the freezer for the days where you're not cooking something. Two pounds for these refuse sacks. They're 50 litres um, and they're extra strong. It looks like I'm going into the catering tray, doesn't it? <laughs> There's 300 metres of tin foil in that one for five quid. And 300 metres of cling film in that one for five quid. So yes, it cost me 10 pounds, but the saving on buying 300 meters, that's just gonna last me forever. So you've got a massive family box of Rice Krispies there for two pounds only. Oh my gosh, one of the things that Iceland do that we are a big fan of, it's my naughty treat. Please do like and subscribe to Hey Mummy and thank you so much for watching this video. Bye guys.